Hey there everyone, George here. Hope you're well. Uh, just messing about with the old Pioneer here. Um, well, we actually have it working now on both channels, which is nice. So, there you go. Uh, Pioneer A221, I think. Let me have a look at the front panel. Yeah, A221. And, uh, only had one channel, but uh, we've that sorted out now. Um, but I just said I'd show you. Made up my own, um, little dim bulb tester or current limiter or poor man's variac whatever you want to call it so um, the reason the bulb is red in case you're wondering is uh, here in Europe it's very very hard to get your hands on incandescent bulbs now because the um, EU has decided that uh, they're not energy efficient enough well they actually decided that a good while ago so um, this bulb here is one for um, an electric fire that has the, the the plastic coal in it this gives you like the the flame effect and uh, this is incandescent and it's 60 watt and um, these are handy enough to get your hands on so the uh, the bulb is in series on the on the live wire and uh, I just had that socket lying about I, I didn't have any single gang ones so I just used that so uh, the idea of it is for those of you that don't understand is that if you have a piece of equipment that um, you've just acquired or uh, you're unsure of or whatever the case may be you uh, you plug it into this guy and uh, what happens is if there is an issue with the machine a short or whatever the case may be the bulb glows bright and it stays glowing bright and it limits the amount of uh, current going to the machine to a very very small amount so the short in the machine is not going to cause any uh, damage uh, well any more damage than what's already going on in there so um, so when everything is going correctly this is what you should have I'm just trying to get everything in shot there that's it it should flick and then it'll dull down to the stage where it's barely glowing and once you turn the machine off, it goes off. So um, I just threw that together today. And uh, handy little thing to have, I suppose, when you're kind of messing about with stuff like this. And that, and that, and that, and that, and that. <laughs> oh, man. Yes, yeah, getting out of hand. Okay, uh, 73, guys. And uh, we'll get you in the next one. If you're uh, new here, be sure to subscribe and we'll get you again in the next one. Uh, this is George, GI7 Kilo Oscar. Bye-bye.